This is Omar Miller, and you're watching The Three Point Conversion. Uh, it's been going well. Um, I think we've been super competitive. Um, at the same time, having fun with it, you know. Uh, this is the first time, like, the whole team is really here together and then, like, just going super, super hard. Like, the, the practice has been super intense. Um, but it's just, like, being out there, just I can see, like, what type of team we could be. And I really feel like we could make some noise this year. Talent gap. What would you say are some of the biggest differences between, I guess, preseason practices at UConn and this in terms of what you guys work on, what you focus on, sort of like the overall field? Oh, uh, well, I don't know how it is at other schools, but at UConn, it was like the same. <laughs> like, we used to get after it for real, like training camp, like boot camp, all that. So I'm prepared for this. This is just. I guess what's the biggest transition for you right now? Trying to figure out, is it trying to figure out the offense, defense? Like, what's, what are you learning right now to, to kind of go out there and be the player you want to be in the floor? Um, yeah, just like all the little things, for real. Um, just having all the vets in my ear, um, telling me what it takes to be a good player. Um, shit, just competing hard, in and out. Um, Terry said he was going to kill me, so I'm guarding him every possession. Uh, we going at it. Um, I ain't take that lightly for all those asking. Um, shit, and just, just listen to them. You know, you got to be able to listen and, and soak in information. I was going to ask you about that. He said he wants to kill you, but obviously he said it in jest because he knows he's going to make you a better player. For sure. So what about that? How much do you want him to kind of go out there and give his best to kind of make you the player you want to be? Yeah, no, nah, Terry a tough, a tough player to play against. Uh, super shifty, fast. But then on the other end, he like we teammates, so you know he just he pointed me in the right direction. He told me, like I said, what it takes to be a good player in this league. Uh, he been in here for a minute. Uh, he's an all star to me. Uh, I think he's an all star. Um, anybody who don't, I don't know what to tell you. Uh, just just having him in my ear, that's like for all I can ask for. For you and Kyle, um, obviously, JT's kind of too, but for you and Kyle, you got first round picks and everything. Yeah. Come in here and get his team some gear and athleticism and stuff like that. Have you guys talked about that at all? I mean, what do you, what do you expect to kind of bring to the team, both of you guys? Um, man, we we both looking to come in and contribute off the bat right away. Um, I know I'm going to get that chance. I know I'm going to get an opportunity. I'm going to be ready to take full advantage of um, it in any which way, um, on offense and defense, um, being a playmaker. Um, not turning the ball over. Um, uh, just being a solid player, solid two way player. Yeah. 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 For sure. Um, I feel like in summer league, it was like the opposite. I feel like I was playing most of like the one. Like, um, and it was just totally like, just like foreign to me. You know, most of my life I've been playing a two and then here and there I play on the ball, but try and run the point the whole game is just, that's tough. So, um, and here it's like the same, just working on playing on the ball, playing off the ball, um, cutting, um, doing like, doing a little dirty work, getting in there, get them rebounds, them scrappy rebounds. Uh, I'm just really working on everything, a little bit of everything. Your favorite moment of the week so far, something that's kind of really stood out of like, okay, this is a lot different than what I was doing in college, or this is a lot different style of game and players? Um, I'd say trying to box out Mason. It's just like, that's that's crazy. Like, you know what I'm saying? Me trying to box out Mason, <laughs> it's different. Like, just the strength of players, the speed of the game. How fast everybody is, how talented everybody is. Um, really, it's just like trying to get stops. Defense is like the hardest thing for like you gotta really lock in it and be able to focus on that under the floor. How much is JB taking under his wing a little bit to kind of help you out with like, your ropes and stuff out there? I'm sure it's kind of I mean, you got to go to his house on Sunday. Yeah. How does he kind of try to help you along with the progression here so far? 
Oh no, Co- coach has been like uh, unbelievable for me. Um, he's like right at your fingertips. Um, I could talk to him whenever. He's always around. He's always around the facility. Um, he makes jokes with me. We play around, but we know when it's time to lock in, and and he's gonna be on me if I if I'm not doing what I'm supposed to be doing. Um, everything from making a, a a good pass and a shooting drill, you know, all the way to a sprint to the corner and and, and shooting open shots, you know, so. Coach, coach has been nothing but great for me, and I'm, I'm excited to get things started. Can you explain your second level right now? I mean, does this feel real? I mean, this feels like a dream. Talk to you, draft day, you know, something you feel like a dream. Does it feel real to you now? Yeah, nah, it, it feel real to me. It's like once uh, once some uh, training camp started, it was like, no, nah, I'm here. It's just time. It's time to lock in. No, no doubt. Appreciate y'all. Absolutely.